Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. Today I have another Timu haul. Like I said in my last one, I've kind of gone out of control. It's like my newest guilty pleasure. I could spend hours scrolling on their app. I placed this order kind of like a few weeks ago, so I've been saving everything to show you. I'll have everything linked down below. I have like an affiliate code with them. I think it gets you... 20 or 30 percent off and they give you a credit so definitely take advantage if you haven't downloaded the app they also have coupons and a bunch of things so never get something full price but yeah i'm so excited to get into it let's get started i got this herb preserver thing i saw on tiktok last year that if you put cilantro in water and you put it in the fridge but it has to be covered it lasts so much longer and y'all I swear to god it works so so well it doesn't get like mushy and nasty and brown so i thought this was a great solution you can pour or replace the water from here and then it gets covered in the fridge and i love that it's not too big and bulky and this was literally a dollar you know if this wasn't sitting in a box in my filming room i could have put this on one of my dogs today but i did not i did not um because it's raining but this is a doggy poncho i should get more though because i have to Two more dogs but i want to see their sizing and i would say this front's pretty small this is a medium but for skippy i definitely need something smaller and for penny i might need a large because she a chunky girl i wish so badly i would have known about timo or like that it was a thing back when my daughter was younger because they have so many amazing toys for dirt cheap on amazon is 32 dollars or more is this digital like toddler kids camera actually takes pictures actually takes videos and then you get to and export it to your phone or computer which is so crazy i'm gonna show y'all because i couldn't believe it oh shit what did i do oh here we go wow that's flattering But the point is this is so cute and it was like five dollars i also got a ton of undies i have these that are more of like a bikini but they're both this really nice rip material they feel nice like to the touch but i'm gonna wash them and then wear them for a bit and then i'll review them and then i got the thong style these were for some reason like more expensive than these i'm glad i got all of these for like less than 20 bucks it's like such a good deal and then these i already have in a different style and i really like how thick they are but i had to get these because these are my initials and that's like obviously not even planned so now i have these all right a few random things i got these temporary tattoos that are meant to look like real tattoos i thought it was fun this little concealer brush that i've been eyeing on amazon was only a dollar on timo these are nail stickers i already gave them a try but i definitely think i need to wear a top coat so they don't fade as quick this is for the dogs you put the shampoo in here and then you're able to squeeze it out using this. I thought this was perfect, but it is silicone, so we'll see if it works out well for them. Oh, these were cute. They're little highlighters in pastel colors. This I've had for a bit. I forgot to show you all in my very first haul, but this is a little box cutter in the shape of a flower. So cute. And this is a privacy like eraser. Let me show you all. I don't really have any letters or anything to show you all, but I can do it here. So you just go through the information and it's just to erase any personal things that you don't want people to find in your trash, I guess. But it was like two bucks. This that I think is going to come in handy for travel. And she's already been playing with it. She actually really liked it. It was dirt cheap, y'all. Okay, I wanted to test this one out before even showing y'all because I was right and there is some leakage happening I don't know what the heck is wrong with it or if it's just too cheap to hold it. I got a few like engagement type rings because I've been wanting to get a travel slash gym one. And this is the one that I really liked. I think it's really pretty. It has a lot of character. It's not too big but not too small it's just such a fun shape so it's very different from my actual engagement ring and i really like it i've been wearing it mostly to see if it's gonna tarnish because this was literally like a dollar but i will let you guys know how it goes this is a car little trash can for the side of the door i thought this was convenient just to throw like 
the straw paper and things like that or the paper from the straws i don't know things like that because it might seem like a little bit of trash at a time but when it really accumulates and you're cleaning out your car you're like dang how did it get this bad and it starts with those little crumbs of paper so i thought this was nice i don't know what's inside but i guess i'll figure it out my best friend inspired this purchase she has a pocket pharmacy as the kids like to call it i like that this one has like smaller slots two big ones um, for like thumbs for example it's more compact and i get to bring a ton of different medicines but also separate them this is something that's been missing from my travel kit i guess so i'm gonna take the cricket and just put something quirky on it or something <laughs> I don't know who requested like if I could try one of these towels but I kind of messed up and I got the hearts and you definitely meant the strawberry but here we are it's cute it's just like not very defined I feel like from afar it looks you know very cute but then you see it and the hearts are like kind of barely there I mean they're there it's just like not the best quality it's, it is really soft but like it's tiny this is like a hand towel for sure so i accidentally ordered it twice so i'll definitely return one and keep the other but it's nice it's just like is it three dollars nice i don't know and a ton of party supplies that's another thing that i think they're really good for i got these holographic moon plates for olivia's birthday i got more of these tips and piping bags that are reusable because i tried doing my mom's cake the other day and didn't turn out good because i didn't have these balloons um these are little pouches like juice pouches that i'm gonna diy for her birthday as well it was like seven dollars for a ton of them some food picks in the shape of stars just because her birthday theme i don't think i've talked about it on here but i did on tiktok it's to the moon so the number two because she's turning two the moon so it's like planets and stars and moons and things like that and i got some birthday candles because i was running out and these were super cute i'm not gonna lie some of these things i am returning they're not my favorite like this car like i want something to store olivia's toys and i should have known better this was three dollars but it's too small and like uh, flimsy and not really what I'm looking for. I want like something that covers the whole back of the car seat and that way I can just put like stuff that we need for car rides with her. But in their defense, I guess this does fit a tablet, which is like kind of what it's intended for. But my daughter's rear facing and she will stay like that as long as it's in my hands i totally blame one tiktoker that i wish i knew her name i love her she makes all these pasta dishes and she's so like knowledgeable and kind i'm obsessed um i blame her for this purchase i've been wanting one of those like food scraping tools and they had it for so cheap it is stainless steel it concerns me slightly that it's not gonna last but we'll see and it also has all these measurements so that's nice then this uh, i got it through their influencer like gifting platform and <laughs> i mean like is it the worst thing ever no i really enjoy these um food saver things when you only use half of something i have like a lemon and an avocado but i always use half an onion for some reason so i thought it'd be nice to have that way it won't stink up the other things and it's kind of sustainable so because you don't use plastic wrap or ziplocs you know how i love a tangent i recently got my dream rug from anthropology 70 percent off something crazy it's an 8x10 rug i got it for less than 400 dollars and it's usually 2900 something and i thought what could possibly make this rug be on clearance plus an extra 40 percent off and then i got it in the mail and i realized why it's because it shreds worse than the three of my dogs combined and i don't know if this is like an initial coating of shredding or if it's gonna continue to happen it's too bad because i really can't return it so you know dreams turn into nightmares sometimes i am losing my mind i even look crazy anyway not the point the point is i think this is gonna try this is gonna try to help no this might help so i'll show you guys if it works but if not i thought it would be nice to have for just a rug since we all shred in this household apparently i've been wanting to get these from amazon they are these adhesive hooks these 
do feel a little flimsy like they're not gonna hold much weight so i might even put like a reinforcement with melting tape but these are just so convenient to have when you don't really want to mess with like command hooks that are more expensive okay guys so that's everything for today's video i i need to chill out but if y'all are enjoying timo hauls let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and leaving me a comment so i can keep doing them because i need some justification for my actions i will not stop shopping <laughs> on Timu. I like as we speak I have like four more packages coming it's just so insane but I'm really enjoying shopping on there I think it's very affordable and yeah hits and misses like most things but their returns are so easy that I don't get concerned that something's gonna suck anyway that's everything for today's video if you enjoyed it please give it a big thumbs up I'll talk to you guys very soon in my next one